you know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. Now, <laughs> very soon, <clears throat> I got baby. I want my. You know what that means now? <laughs> ah, brother, no, no, no. It's not now. I want to be through with my studies first. Yes, of course you be through with your studies. And let me tell you, if I ever come here and see anybody hanging around here, eh? Okay, my hand up, double bar. Ooh, ooh, Shoot the person. Brother, story. Akuko. You that don't even come to the village often. Is it when you are in the city that you will know? You don't even want me to come to the city. So tell me, how will you see anybody close to me? Ah, Mua mm. doesn't want you to come to the city. No, now. That is not possible. Feel free to call me anytime. Call me, call Daniel. I mean, we are, we are, we are yours too. Nobody can stop you from coming to see us. Okay? Okay. After all, my father trained your elder ones, isn't it? Yes, you're uh -huh. correct. But I have good news for you. Good news? Yes. Share me, share, share. I can't wait. What's I've, the good news? <laughs> I've gained admission. My, oh my. You've gained admission. Congratulations. On which of the institutions? Federal College Umunze on a degree course. Wow. Federal College Umunze on a degree. You see what I'm saying? You see why you need to be close to me? You see why you need to be close to my wife? You see, when, you, when you're far away from us, you allow my wife's relations to be taking things that belong to you. If you know what that means. I know, brother. Good. Okay, I promise I'll be coming close now. Good, good. <laughs> hey, what about your father? Um, he went to Okonko's house to get pan wine. Um, Okonko's house. Please, can you go over there and tell him I'm here? I'm waiting for him. Okay, sure. Please, just make yourself comfortable. I'm coming back. I should make myself comfortable in my own house. <laughs> but I hope you bought something for me, oh. Hey. Mama, go and call your father. <laughs> ah, look at my sister. She's grown into a beautiful woman. Where are you going to ask someone? My uncle is at our house and I'm going to call my father. Okay, wait. Let me tell you something before you go. What is it? Okay, now I've told you to go and carry your importation from Rosemary and leave me alone. This girl has actually spoilt my name among these village sweet girls. Kai! What should I do to that idiot? Ah. So how did you go? He's not there. Oh. Okonko said he left for the palace to see the Igwe. And the palace is very far. I can't trek there. He didn't even go with his phone because we don't have light for like two weeks now. Mm. I would have called him. It's okay. Uh, don't worry, okay? Don't worry. Just tell him I was here. Let me go see my mother. But I will sure see him before I go back to the city. Okay. Mm. Are you going back today? Sure, sure, I will. Sure, I will. Okay. Um, don't forget all I told you. Hmm? You know you are the last born and uh, you've been the one taking care of Papa. But remember, you still have others. Hmm? Try and be visiting them, you know go? I will, brother. But it's very, very important. I will. Darling. Yes, brother. Thank so, you. So, let me be on my way now. Okay, brother. Mm -hmm. but, brother, is it when you come back that you bring what you bought? <laughs> Ugoma. Sir? Well, let me... Oh, oh, okay. Can you join me to the car? Yes, sir. So that I would do something for you. Okay, brother. You will never stop. Okay. <laughs> 
Go there, uncle. Good day, my son. No need to ask. You are looking good. Thank you, uncle. Thank you. I I went to your house, but uh, Ugoma told me you were not at home. That you went to see uh, Okonko. She went there and said you were not there. Oh, I'm sorry, my son. I left his house for the palace. Okay. And that's where I'm coming from. What can we do? Can we go to my house? Uh, no, uncle, no. I, I have a limited time. I want to go and see my mother. Hey, come to think of it. You complained about my mother. So, don't you think this is the best time to go see her together? So we'll sort everything out before her. My son, you are making sense. In that case, uh, let me keep this. And quickly meet you here now. All right. Hello, precious. You've been snobbing my call, right? Why are you sobbing? It's okay, stop crying. Where are you at? Yes, how do I locate where you are now? All right. I agree to you. I just greeted you, man. You didn't answer. Oh, by force, you put. Is it by force to respond? And do you, Ibekwe? You think I will change my mind by bringing him here? Who pay? My other stance. Mama. And why did you break Ugoma's gallon and spill the water she fetched from her uncle's house? Why? Was this question why you left your office at the city to come and ask me? Do you have any problem with Uncle Ibekwe? Apart from the land you told me he cleared. And he went ahead to cultivate on that land after the meeting we had. You couldn't do anything. First son for that matter. Mama. But you had nothing to do with that land. Okwebeko here is a farmer. He's been using it. If you want another land, tell me. If you want to use any land, I will give you land. Why are you asking me? Eh? Obina. Are you saying I cannot protect my husband's property? I don't blame you. I know you hate your mother. I do not blame you. I will blame God. Because if he had given me a female child, I would not be here talking this nonsense with this thing since it's never. That's why you planned with your wife to beat up your mother and you couldn't do anything about it. Don't worry. I have said what I want to say. I do not want them to fetch water from that borehole again. And that is fine now. Come, come. Kenkina was my wife for queer. Why are you calling her name? Kenkina, we have What concerns her what we are saying? Mama, listen, listen. Like you rightly said, I am the first son. And by virtue of that, whatever my dad was doing when he was alive, I take over. Mama, I'm in charge here, not you. I said not anymore. If you want your clan people to be fetching water there, take a bottle for them at the village square. Not this one, my husband, and the eye dog. It was my father who dug that bottle, and not you. He was benevolent enough to say, okay, villagers, come and be fetching water. How the hell does it affect you? He was my husband before he became your father. Yeah. Yes. If not for my help, on what on your body now? Well, I have lost my appetite because saliva and sarasa. Yeah, I know you are hungry. I know. Let me give this to my dog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Listen, when you are done sitting and blabbing, eh? Just take him where you brought him from. I don't want to see you this here. This is not my father's legacy. Mama, this is not my father's legacy. My father was a good man. Don't spoil his legacy. He was a good man, was I? Yes! Was I? Have you for once asked me what I had wanted as a woman, as a mother? Why would you convert this man to come here and start talking nonsense? You should have come here first, asked me what happened, and not going to his house to bring him. Give your nazo for so name Nanketinabo. He is your uncle, yes. But your mother should come first before your uncle. Non suckability. Don't forget to lock my gate. What's going on? Oh, what is all this? What is going on? Is what has gone wrong? Oh, I, I, I'm sorry about this, okay? But I'll show our hand. I understand. We have been seen things here. I understand, Obina. Don't worry. I'll handle it, okay? I'll handle it. Let me go. No, I'll, I'll handle it. I'll handle go, it. Let me go. I can't understand. Why was not like I this? I can't now. understand. Let's go. Let's go. What changed my mother? Yeah, uncle. Uncle. Robin, it is good you saw her. This is what we have been passing through since she came back to reside in this village. Your father was my elder brother. Did he ever show you any land that belongs to him personally? No, he did not. That was because we lived in peace. Your father was a nice man. We have not shared any property. I want you to hold that peace like your father did. Do not let your wife or your mother talk ill of your relations. You can see what a woman that, 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 that is married into this family is doing. Uh, don't worry, uncle. Don't worry. Hmm? Don't worry. I will talk to my younger brother to talk to her too. And I believe so much that she will listen to him. Hmm? Please, just calm down. We'll sort it out. Uh, can I drop you off as I'll be leaving for the city immediately? Let's not forget. How is your wife and your daughter, Sandra? Uh, are they back from the Omugwa? No, they are not back yet. But hopefully, they'll be back soon. No, that is all right. That is all right, my dear. Okay, Uncle. Uh, let me drop you off now. Eh? Oh, that's all right. Don't worry. I, I so much believe that my younger brother would uh, talk sense into him. Mm -hmm. So just take it easy. Bro, mom is being unnecessarily wicked and I don't like it. Come on, this is just water. We have it already. It's not like it's deducting money while people are fetching. So why are you stopping people from fetching water? Eh? The last time I intervened, she slapped me. I was like, mom, come down, let them... I didn't tell you. Mama Magola. You didn't tell me. You got You didn't tell me. Mom slapped me because I asked her to let people fetch water. That water is free. Do you know the most annoying part? The one she did to our cousin, Ugoma. I'm telling you. I mean, water is water. That's the least we can give back to the people. In return, why is she holding it as if her life depends on it? I will drive down to the village and talk some senses into more. In giving you receive, make sure you come down and beg. You truly, you truly have to. You really have to go home and talk to Mama. This is getting out of hand now. Right? Mama is destroying Papa's legacy. Papa was a good man. That's Papa's legacy. Papa created that boho so that people in the village 
can fetch water for free. Now, Papa is dead. Mama is saying nobody should fetch water. How will Papa be feeling in his grief? She was not like this when Papa was alive. Papa knew the village needed water. Abi? What is water? What is bubble? We have it. Let me go first. They are hugging me as the money is balancing and I'm trying to have it. Hmm? It's a just try and talk to her and I hope she listens to you. So how did it go? Not too well, sir. Mr. Steven has not completed the documents, and I told him how urgent we might be in need of it. What is the meaning of this? I don't understand. What kind of report is this? And when did Mr. Steven bring in this one? This morning, sir. So where have you been? I've been searching for you everywhere this time. I even went to that club where we picked you people that night. I met your friend. She gave me your number. But each time I call that number, a man picks and speaks to you. A man? Uh -huh. Are you married? That's a joke. Can I see the number? Is this not your number? Now you make mistake now. What do you have? My number is 23, not 32. Oh, ah, 23, no? My bad. Uh -uh, I foresee. This time I call that man will be like, wait, wait, wait. he speaks what I don't understand. And he's so rude. Goodness like you. Yes. Come on. Let's not go there, please. You look stressed out. What has been happening to you? Where have you been? How is that important? Come on, where whose whereabouts is not important to a rich guy like you. Calm down. Calm down. Your friend told me you traveled. She, she should as well told you where I went to. Listen, 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 Daniel. I am not interested in this conversation. I'm not in the right frame of mind for this. Honestly, I didn't want to talk to you. The moment I left your house, I threw your card away. It was Linda that forced me to make this conversation happen. Please, I'm not interested in anything that has to do with this conversation. I can see your face. You don't like when a woman talks to you like that? Yes, but I will forgive you. I'm interested in you. So you travel to the village to see your parents or what? Well, I went to the village. Oh, I see. I don't have any parents. Your parents stay in the village? I don't have any parents. How possible is that you don't have any parents? Did you fall from the sky? What do you mean by that? My mom is dead. And I don't know who my father is. What? Your mom is dead and you don't know who your father is? That's serious. So who raised you? My granny. She raised me through nursery, primary, secondary, university education. Your granny did all that? Yes. That means you have a rich granny there. You will not understand. You won't understand. Because she's sick. She's sick. It's okay, please stop crying, okay? Stop crying. 
How serious is her sickness? She's dying. <laughs> My grandmother is dying. A problem shared is half solved. <gasps> My grandmother is dying. It's okay. <laughs> She's dying. <laughs> it's okay. A problem shared is half solved. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. <laughs> What is Precious talking about? That her grandmother is dying. How does she want to pull the fast one on me? Because I've been looking for her? No. She can't. The pain on her face was real. But why am I even bothered? I mean, she's just a one-night stand girl. Or better still, uncomfortable her trying to be nice. Yes, yes, Danny. I've been trying to call you all evening. I guess the network was messy. No connect. Yes, I... I want to find out how far you've gone with those files I gave you. They called immediately you left. Yes, yes. The date for the presentation has been shifted. Yes, yes, so. <laughs> four days earlier, four days earlier. So you know what? I would want everything to be ready before Tuesday. You know why? The presentation is on Wednesday. So I really want you to expedite action so you get everything set. So that I'll be prepared for my own angle. Hmm? It's okay. It's okay. Let's try and do your best, eh? All right, now. Zeke. Okay. Bye. Uh -huh. So, you mean Ijen Lu said all this in the presence of who being her first son and he could not do anything about it? What do you expect the young man to do to start fighting his mother? No, but he could have done something as Elendo's first son. No, that one is not important. In my presence, he told her to allow the people get access to the borehole. Uh -huh. And still she refused. She really refused. But the problem here is, when a young man who is grown to get married, is about to marry, he will leave all the grown-up girls within his community and run to a different land to get a wife. If Ijendo had come from this community and knew how hard it is for our children to get water, she shouldn't have been behaving this way. You're right. Huh? You're right, my brother, because I know how much your mother tried for hmm. Lendo to marry from this community. But he refused. Huh. But what can we do? There's nothing we can do. The borehole in question is in her compound. So there's nothing anybody can do about it until she decides on what to do with the borehole. Huh? Do I have spoken to Obina mm -hmm. to tell his younger brother so that they can speak with their mother. But the issue is, will this woman listen to them? Huh. Will she? Yeah. Did you see the doctor when you got there? Yes, I did. Okay. Stop crying. Oh. 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 Stop crying. I'm still alive. You know? Did did the doctor deduct anything from the money he charged us? No, he did not. 
And then he said it, it's very expensive. It's okay. God is still alive. Oh. He knows the best. And I know, I am very, very sure that he will favor us. You know? Stop crying. Stop crying. Oh. Stop crying. Hello? Good morning, Danny. <laughs> Danny. My granny is not doing any better this morning. My wood is crashing. <laughs> you want to come? I'll just send a direction to you now. See, with more seriousness, you'll be through by Tuesday. You see, as it is now, my head is full. I need to clay it off some cobwebs. Yes. And you believe everything will be ready by Tuesday? Are you aware that today is Friday? Yes. I'm aware. I'm aware. I'm aware. Okay. Oh. Go while and let me see what I can do. Please. Please, do something, do something. You know how serious we need that job? You know it. Please, expedite action so we don't lose out on that job. Hmm? Good. Nobody. Yes. Mm -hmm. You are sure? I'm sure. Nobody. Will you come here? Uh, yes, ma. I'll be alone. Yes, ma. You don't have respect. What are these? Okay. Is this um, your urine or a goat came here? No, I took I took water to wash my pot. You know, I just finished the urban soup I cooked a week ago. So I washed every everything. I washed every yourself. So that's why this water they are here. You took water. Wash my, my pot. You took. Did you measure it? Measure. Yes. How many liters did you fetch? Yeah. I just open here. I just open it up. Open it. Open it. I will deduct it from your salary. It's very small. Oh. The water is small. The water is small compared to these ones here. Look at the floor. I don't blame you. When next I am going out, I will load this with key. I will measure the water for you. I know you will be waiting. That man is also called Dorman in UK. Do I blame you? 
I am no longer a teacher. If not, I will just enroll you in my school and flog the hell out of you. Show for local bandage. Two months, eh? Now just bag of trouble. Bag of trouble. I will just pack my 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 bag and go. You can't take with this one. I've told you before, she will be fine. Calm down. Your grandma will be fine. She's in safe hands. So I can we see in the office? It's just a lump in her left breast. Due to negligence, it has become cancerous. When Precious came here the first time, after paying for the lab and all that, I told her that this woman, she needs to be operated on. Else the cancer will develop and it will degenerate to the other one. Is it that serious? Yes, it is very serious. And what she needs now is a surgical operation. Will she survive it? At her age, the chances are 50-50. As you can see, this is a village hospital. We can transfer her to the city where they have modern equipment. Yes. Where is Daniel? Has he been to the office today? No, I've not seen him today, sir. Did he call or drop any message for me? Not at all, sir. His number has not been reachable. What's going on? I've been trying his line without getting any response. It's okay. Just, just... Okay, call him again. Try his line. Try his line. Try his number. Okay, if you sir. get him, tell him to accept you should come to the office immediately. All right, sir. All right. We'll be going on. We'll be going on. Stop crying, okay? Crying will not solve anything. The doctor said Mama Nuku has breast cancer. And the only way she will survive is surgery. So how did Mama Nuku get breast cancer now? <laughs> how did she get breast cancer? Precious, calm down. Shedding mm -hmm. tears will not solve any problem, okay? The doctor says she needs surgery, so let's think about how to raise the money. Okay. So, how much the doctor says it's going to cost? The doctor said the surgery will cost 2.5 million naira. 2.5? What? Ah! And then you go and move on. Oh, we're going to move now. Where do you want me to get 2.5 million naira for? How do you want me to do this? Calm down, calm down, calm down. It's not your fault. <laughs> calm down. I will help you. Yes. Help me. But on one condition. You must promise me that you will never go back to that place. All in the name of looking for money. I told you want me to do. How do you want me to get money to take care of my man? Look, eh? Listen, I'm going to steal any amount of money just to take care of my grandmother. You don't have to steal. You don't understand. 
that's not you. Can't, okay, even if you decide to keep sleeping with men, how many men are you going to sleep with to raise such a man from one local soldier? I know that's not who you are. You say you will not understand. That woman you see paid for my nursery school, my degree. She suffered for me. So you. I would do anything to make sure my man look who's alive. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Don't worry, follow me to my car, okay? I will transfer some money for you or maybe to the doctor so that they can proceed. Yes. But I repeat on one condition. You will never stand anywhere again or you will never go out trying to sleep with any man all in the name of raising money. Do you understand? Deal? Have you administered the drugs on her? Yes, doctor. Please keep an eye on her, check the drips, and give her injection afterwards. Okay, doctor. The patient will want to meet your attention. Alright, I'm coming. Have you been? I've been calling you all day. Sorry for not picking your calls. I was busy. <sighs> you remember Precious? Pregnant. Precious. We forgot it. We went to see her granny. She's sick. Thank you, sir. She's not a girl you picked from the club the other day. She's the one. Her mother is sick. You need to see her condition. Danny. Danny, how could you abandon work in the office? How could you abandon work to tell me you took a slot to see her sick mother? Is she already man? She's not a slut. Take a good look at her. Isn't she beautiful? I feel like wiping this loud smile off your face. Yes, I feel like doing that. What's wrong with you? I expect you to know that there's a difference between pleasure and business. They don't go together. We didn't go there for pleasure. I said we went to see her sick granny. Danny. Danny. Take that girl back to the brothel where she belongs. Yes. I don't ever want to set my eyes on her again. And lastly, make sure those fires are ready by Monday. Excuse me. Danny, make sure you return this girl back to the brothel. Don't ever want to set my eyes on her again. Work first. Excuse me. You know what? I'll just leave. I mean, I heard everything your brother said. And I don't want to be the one to distract you from work, so. Excuse me. Am I the one that said that? Am I the one that said that? Come on. Don't let that get to you. Sit. Don't let what he said get to you, okay? You should be bothered only when I say such. Danny, what is the meaning of this? Danny, what is the meaning of this? You withdrew a 500,000 from my account with Philmont Bank and a 100,000 naira yesterday. What is happening? And so, 
Is that supposed to be a problem? Danny, you ask me if that is supposed to be a problem? Obi, I don't get it. Am I supposed to come lick your ass before we draw in money from an account I'm signatory to? Danny, what did you do with the money? That's none of your business. I needed the money. Besides, we have over 25 million Naira cash in that account. I'm not even talking of um, other assets and properties. So what's the biggie? Danny, but you know what we're passing through now. Is that supposed to be my problem? What are we passing through? On whose effort? Danny, on whose effort? That was daddy's effort. Come on! How can you do this? We are trying to reduce, I mean, cut down on expenses, and you're doing this? Calm down, bro. This is not your money. Stop being authoritative. It's our father's money. Company's money. Family wealth. So calm down, it's not your money. We are trying to cut down on expenses. But your wife is living like being a worker. Your daughter's school fees is on the high side. All from the company's account. Have I ever complained? So why are you making noise because I took this away kid? If we need to cut down on necessary expenses, start from your wife and your daughter. Then you can talk to me. Danny, I want you want to do. You want to walk out on me? Danny, cut down on your expenses. If you continue like this, you will bring down this company. You don't do things that way. You don't know you risk 600,000 naira just in the sense of one week. You didn't tell me. What's, what's wrong? You want to push us to bankruptcy? Danny, you need to calm down. You need to organize yourself. This is not right. What's going on? Sir, is everything okay? I overheard you shouting. It's okay, it's okay. Just go back to your office. Tell the field manager to see me immediately. Okay. But sir, whatever it is, please do take it easy. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll handle it. I'll handle it. Hmm? I'll handle it. Okay. Sir, so, yes. he's your younger brother and I have taken time to watch him. He still thinks he is good. Or probably he doesn't want to be serious with the establishment. Well, just follow him with wisdom. Say some wisdom. Choke some wisdom till when? I mean, some wisdom till when? Chooks, look at you. You're married with kids. Are you older than Daniel? I don't think so. Yes, he had a girlfriend when he was in school and the girl left him for a white guy she met online. Since then, Danny hates women. Telling him about marriage sounds like a taboo to him. All he does is hobnob with different girls in different clubs in town. Different clubs? Yeah. That is really serious. Then you have to talk to your mother about it. Let your mother talk some sense into Daniel. My point here is you shouldn't be harsh on Daniel. Just give him time, he will change. Be calm with him. I've not been harsh to him. I've been trying to speak sense into him. You see, what hurts me now is that my, my late father will not be happy wherever he is. This was not his legacy. 
not all. There you go. I, I understand where you're going to. Uh, just be calm, sir. Things should be fine. I mean, with time, that they will match up. I know, but remember, time is of the essence. Time is of the essence. I also feel your sir. Time is of the essence. Mama. Hmm. I brought food for you. So you can eat. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not hungry. Ma, you have to eat, though. No, Mama, you have to eat. I brought food for you, so you have to eat. You need to eat food. And now, you go. So you can eat something. You have to try and eat a little bit, okay? At least something has to enter your tummy. Sorry, Mama. Go. Mama, I think we have to bring Jacoby back. You need more attention now. You need too much attention now. And I know that Chikube is still going to school and how hard things are, but Mama, please, she has to come back. I took her away so that things will be easier for us. Bringing her back will add to expenses in this family. Yeah. My my surgery requires huge amount of money. Bringing Chekwe back, we add to it. Mama, Chekube has to come back. My friend Daniel gave me money for the surgery. Everything. So at least we have some time to breathe another fresh air. Mama, while I'm hustling to look for money, Chekubi has to cook food for you. So she has to come back. Wait. Did you just say that someone gave you money for my surgery? Yes, Mama. Yes. You now have money for my surgery? Mama, I have money for your surgery now. So I'm going to meet the doctor to know the next movement. Precious mom. Precious mom. Hey. You have tried so much for your grandmother. You have done so much for me. Hey. What would I have done without you? Yeah? Since this sickness started, you have been toiling day. At night. Hi. Hi. Hey, Chukuna. Chukuna. Hi. You know how this sickness started. You know how it will end. Mama, I am sure you will see me through. It's okay. Now, it's time for you to be happy. At least help us come from above. Okay. 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 It's well. I'll go and see the doctor. Mama, you have to eat enough food now. Enough food. Mm -hmm. Keep the food later we eat. I don't have appetite. Uh, Mama, you have to... After everything, you still don't have appetite. We have it, we come. But you have to eat, though. No. You can't waste this food now. Do you, no, no, no. See, keep it in the drawer here. In four days' time. Because the team went for a conference. All you have to do is to make payments. Take it to what happened. have to make payment to you. No. The team have an account. You can make payment to the account. 
guarantee it. Sure, the nurse will give it to you. Doctor, it seems you're part of the team. Yes, we are all surgeons. We form the team. So for us to help people with such cases, to free them for such deadly disease. Don't worry, your grandmother will be fine. Hello. Hello. Good evening, Danny. How was your day? Fine. How is Mama Nuku? Mama Nuku is here. I just got to tell you what the doctor said about her movement. Okay, I'm listening. The doctor said that Mama Nuku will be leaving for her surgery on Thursday. Okay. Have you made the payment? Yes, I have. Danny. Thank you. Thank you so much. I told Mama Nuku about everything you did. And she would love to see you. You know, she's so relieved. I see her life come back. That the God will bless you. For standing for Mama Nuku. For doing everything for her. God will bless you. God will never, ever, ever leave your side. It's okay. It's okay. You're crying. You would understand. No man, look who's all I've got. Don't worry. I'll tell you. Someday. <laughs> I hope my man, look is not seeing your tears. Oh, she's sleeping. At least now you have me and Mama Nuku will be fine. Thank you. I do so you don't know what you have been doing after my warning to you and that is why you're threatening me with death okay see i don't want to have anything to do with you again can't you understand i heard you were at the market yesterday calling my name that i made you pregnant look don't tempt me I have warned you earlier. Don't tempt me. Okay now. Are you not supposed to be happy that I want to make a first and an only son like you have an offspring? Hmm? Secondly, you're supposed to be happy that you have been confirmed a man. Do you know how many men in this village who cannot impregnate a woman? Eh? And you're here warning me. Did I you're beg warning me. Did I beg no way, I know what to do. Did I you want to kill me up here? Did I beg you to confirm if I'm a man? You think I don't know that I am a man? I know that I am a man. Let this be the last one I'll give to you. Don't worry, I know what to do. You want to kill me up here? Don't worry. Amarachi. Amarachi. Why you can't your brother? Warn him. I know why I'm keeping quiet on all his threats. I just left him now and he threatened to kill me. Do you know I can walk quietly to the police station, make an entry, and they'll come and pick him up? Do you know that? I don't understand what is happening between you and my brother, Ikenna. 
You said you're pregnant for my brother, and my brother said he's not responsible. To me, I don't want all these things. I told me I don't want. Everybody in this community have heard it from you. Even if you're pregnant, must you go around announcing it? Are you not a woman? Don't you have shame? Hi, I'm actually the one saying this to me. Don't I have shame? I don't say it to any other person apart from Uguma, who is a friend. And your brother wants to date her, so I should keep quiet up, yeah? And you're saying if, if I'm not ashamed. So what do you want now? To marry my brother or what? I don't know. He's your brother. Both of you should plan on the next thing to do before I will terminate this pregnancy. Are you aware that his master sent him back to this village? And since then, he has nothing doing. So how will he take care of you? That is not my business. It does not concern me at all. It does not. Whether he does anything or, or he jumps up and down, me, I don't care. All I know is that you people should come and see my people. Else I will think of the next thing to do. And you know what that means. I'm actually, you know what that means. Talk to Iken now. Talk to Iken now. <laughs> hey, okay. If I'm not ashamed, you're asking me. Whatever your plans are, just be very careful, please. Hey. Oh, God. What is all this? So what do you want to do now? Because you don't even know your left from your right. You see, all the girls in this community, it was Rose that you got pregnant. What is wrong with Rose? Is she not a human being? Then why are you running? Your goods are back. Go and clear them now. Your goods are back. Hey. I didn't mama is still alive. So this is all she will be seeing. Hey. Mama will be weeping in her grave. Don't worry, very soon I will leave this community for you. So you can just, you will do whatever you want with yourself. Bia, yeah. Amarachi, enough of this. If Rose insists that she's pregnant, fine. Let her have the child. Then we proceed from there and know who is responsible for that pregnancy. Let me warn you. Let this be the last time I will see her in this house. Or even use my name round the village. Because I will not spare her. I will not. You are just backing for nothing. You are just raising your voice for nothing. Better go and carry your goose. Oh. Your goose have landed. Go and carry it. Are you sure of what you're saying? I am Have I water in my mouth? You see that woman, he gender. She's a wicked woman who doesn't like anything good coming from this woman now. And her reasons, nobody can tell. Ugo ma. Ugo? Papa. Nem come. Nem. Ah, good day, sir. Ah, no. Ugo ma kedo. I'm fine, sir. Adam. Since you and Woka for are closer, Please, I want you to go and stylishly find out if there are other people who fetches water from that house. Please. Ah, ah, Papa, it's not something she's hiding now. She allows people to fetch water. Are you not aware that Mbafo is from her own side? And she allows all the children from that side to fetch water from her bottle. You see? You see? Nobody ever told me this. I, don't know. I am not aware. Yeah. I don't know what we did to her. I don't know. Yeah. Except that um, on the day of her traditional marriage, mm -hmm. uh, there was too much rain. Mm -hmm. And um, most of us left because we couldn't wait for her to dress up yes. and display in her traditional regalia. Uh -huh. uh, apart from that, I don't know what we did to her. But that is not an issue. I was there. You know how long I was in the hospital because of pneumonia complications? Yes, I'm aware. Yeah. Ada, hmm, Papa? go. Oh, okay, okay, sir. Thank you. Okay, my brother. I am getting angry because of this news. Hmm. Okay, I am getting seriously angry. I must react. 
Uh, what of Daniel? Has he visited the village since that time? That one, he has not. And I am seriously angry about that because I don't know why. And when I will react now, he will come here to protect her. But I must react. Yes. Okonkwa, I must react. You must do something. Okonkwa, must I must react. You must do something. What is the problem with these children? You must do something. What kind of family is this? What is the meaning of Where you know the girl Danny picked from the club? What are you doing here? Give me the money, sir. So what are you doing here? Give me the money! Are you crazy? Rubbish! What are you doing here? <laughs> Danny, hold on. Danny, hold on. Give me the money. So this girl is responsible! Danny, stop! So this girl is the reason why you've abandoned your job, you refuse to pick us. What is she doing here? Can you remember? How dare you lay your filthy hands on my girl? Yes, I will. Then yes, I will. This girl is not good for you. We picked her from the club and I respected her. When you're done, you let her go. And you, am I a beg you? Are you to tell me what is good for me? And what I don't what care, you. I've warned you before. I don't want to see you in this house again. Yes, you had a deal with my brother. He paid you for the deal. So it is expected that you go back to where you're coming from. Leave our house, don't pollute our house. Ah, you leave! You're fighting me, no. You're fighting me, no. You're fighting me. 